Hey, ground folks, I told you guys I would be back. This is your hostess with the most is Donna Smith, a.k.a. Lady D. I am here to bring you a grown folk topic of discussion. We are going to go there in a minute. Um, soon as I can kind of, I should have had this on my radar before I clicked on here, but that's okay because things just come to me. But let's talk about, um, let's, uh, Let's talk about, since Mother's Day is in the air, let's talk about this. You know, mothers, man, they are the bomb. They're awesome. They're everything. And it's a lot of uh, media around it during that time of season. There's a lot of, um, man, everywhere you look, there's things happening on the radio. There's things happening on the TV. There's things happening on your social media. There is um, a flower shop on every corner. There is mothers who are just being recognized everywhere. They are notorious. And then when we come to Father's Day, things kind of trim, slam down a little bit. It's not as um, out there as it is on Mother's Day. And, you know, I always wondered about that. Maybe you have too. You know, I think both parents, um, man, is, is very special. I mean, they both came together to bring this life. And um, for some reason, the dads don't really get the credit that they should. And some of you may relate to what I'm saying. Some of you may not. Some of you may think that, well, the mothers are the ones who carry the child for nine months. The dad plants the seed and hey, she should be the one. She is the one that's been there even when the daddies are not. But then we have to look at, there's a lot more now single dads that's raising their children and um, alone because the mothers are absent from the home for whatever reason. She may just have decided to get up and leave and this is not for me, this motherhood thing. Or she could have some type of personal uh, issue medically, or she could also have some type of substance abuse issue or be incarcerated herself. So it's more prevalent now in this, I say, decade where um, fathers are taking the active role as mothers. And during the Mother's Day season, are they actually getting their just due and their props for that? Hmm. Something to think about. So if you like, this is just a short, sweet, something off the top of my head, a reality question. You know, send a comment. Give me your thoughts. What do you think about this Mother's Day exaggeration compared to Daddy's Day? And why is that? Why do we as a people tend to go there? And why aren't we giving dads more props now for being active daddies and mommies um, with the mothers being missing? Now, we do give mothers props when they're doing mommy and daddy roles being single parents, right? 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 Okay. Somebody had posted on this briefly in, in this um, in this flavor, this arena where I'm going, and, and it just kind of stuck with me interesting thought um in regards to mommy and daddy days so hit me my name is donna smith your hostess with the most as i can be reached on facebook under donna smith also twitter miss lady d111 also my website donna smith grown folk talk dot com and also these videos are on YouTube. I need you to click on there, Donna Smith, a.k.a. Lady D. Subscribe to my channel. Don't just watch the video and leave a comment here and there and poof, be gone. Subscribe. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.